Let's go to our 10 News School of the Week powered by Duke Energy Florida. This week it is Countryside High School in Clearwater. That's where we find Brightside reporter Sean Stryker. He's live in the science lab. Sean, what's going on? What's up, Robbie? All right, so I have to just tell you what these students are doing. It is so, so interesting. They are culturing mammal cells, and what they are working with is mice. So basically, they are growing mice cells outside of a mouse outside of the body. So it's just really cool. This is Biotech 3. We are in the Biotech lab, which is a part of the uh, iSTEM Academy. And I'm here with the principal of this school, Mr. Sh uh, Schlereth. You're right. I got it. I think I got it. Yeah. So yeah, we are in the Biotech lab, the iSTEM Academy. Uh, there are a couple other programs in this iSTEM Academy as well, TV production, uh, as well as cybersecurity. And these students can earn certifications in these classes. Correct. Um, in cybersecurity, we, we, those are tough network security licenses for kids to get, and we had a student the other day test and be, uh, CompTIA cybersecurity analysts, and that's the top certification that we have had at this school. We test more um, higher certifications in CompTIA certifications, and obviously there's lower certifications to Microsoft Bundle, Adobe Photoshop, and things like and that. And they can earn a lot of money just coming out of high school. I researched what the young man uh, got the certification in being an analyst. He could probably walk out of here making seventy to $80,000 out of high school. I think I need to go back to high school. Uh, some other things as well, not with the iSTEM Academy, but students can still earn certifications in. You know, we, we want kids to be ready for college, career, or life, and so we offer things at the school, for, such as our child care program, where we have an on-site child care. And the students can get state certification and in, in, in the state certification license for child care. And we also have a food and nutrition class. And those students can go on and take certification too. In fact, she tested 12 students this year in a class and 11 of them passed the certification test. That is so cool. That is so great. And really, like you said, it's about preparing the students for the future, whether that is to enter the workforce or continue their education in college or, or whatever that post-secondary education may be. And these students are definitely prepared, Rob. I walked in here and uh, I feel like I got such an education over the past uh, 45 minutes or so. I uh, feel a little inferior. These students definitely smart here at Countryside High School. Well, don't feel inferior, Sean, but I'll tell you what, 70, 80 grand out of high school, that's pretty good. Amazing to see what they're doing out there. That is Sean Stryker reporting for us. We'll check back in with him in just a few minutes. If you know of a school here in the Bay Area that we should feature as our 10 News School of the Week, powered by Duke Energy Florida, send a nomination to 10schools at WTSP.com.